This matchup can take us anywhere. It's a false count anywhere contest. No countouts and no disqualifications. Yeah, this type of match, it doesn't take long for things to get completely insane. Anything goes. That's one of the reasons there's little time to recover from an opponent's attack in a false count anywhere encounter. Well, that is a sign that definitely gets the point across. Jay puts a stop to that. Jawbreaker! Some power behind that punch. Oh, what a wind up. Ball from the rope. Saw it coming. Rock and drop kick. And where does he think he's going? Look, he's just taking the perfect opportunity to regain some composure. Big time atomic drop. I don't have you walking funny. He's absorbed some damage already. Falls count anywhere matches are uniquely demanding. He should know that. And it seems like you have to be at least a little sadistic to be victorious in an ODQ match. Oh, come on, Cole. It's not about being sadistic. It's about being smart. There's no safety net in a no disqualification match, and that's a big factor in succeeding. There's nothing sadistic about it. Getting carried. I'm sure what they're thinking. Oh, right to the floor. Suplexes, slams, and bombs are all painful, but being slapped like that is... And he goes for the pin! And a kick out. Able to squeeze that shoulder out. So close. Taking this to the floor. Raw drop kick. Elbow drop. Across the chest. And Jay saw it coming. It seems like that slap might have had a little extra hostility behind it. Oh, big overhand. He's taking some good hits. Then kick right to the gut. How insulting is that? Just tap. Oh, look at the creativity here. He breaks out. It has to be demoralizing to just get slapped like that. If yeah, that doesn't fire you up, I don't know what will. From a seated position, this takes tremendous power. He had it scouted. Uh-oh. Counters that. He catches Jimmy with a counter. A oh, slap. I don't know if we're going to have any taste buds left after that. And we just saw some serious offense. Whip down the barricade. Goes right through it. Is it enough here? One, two, he beats the count. If the ref was only in better position, that would have been three. And he gets delivered back into the ring. And there goes Jimmy Uso, sent to the outside hard. He's outside the ring now. Hope he's got a plan. Ooh! Thrown out of ringside and back to the mat.
misses the mark. This has just been an absolute massacre. Jim Uso is going to need to get his comeback on lockdown. Good call. And he gets delivered back into the ring. Jumping clothesline! What agility! Here it comes. Stay away from the world. The Tequila Sunrise. Oh. Will this match end on a submission? Uh well, that was a great counter to the single leg crab. Uh oh. Jump has been. I think Jimmy and Jay have the WWE Universe split straight down the middle. When brothers go to war, you know it's going to be intense, but these two are truly on another level right now. Whoa, not quite yet. Line takes him down. Forget about it. Able to elude it. Jay is showing his instincts. task for Jay to recover after tonight's battle. Sent into the corner. And Jimmy able to reverse that. That was just disrespectful. Samoan drop. Up the turnbuckles. What's he gonna do? Tap road. Jimmy Uso splash. Look at Jay. His lights are on. What a crucial kick out. And the blood is still pumping for Jay Uso. It must be Uso. Uso splash! Jimmy Mann just finished things. Two count. There's your winner, ladies and gentlemen. Jimmy Uso. Here's another quick look at some of the highlights. Here is your winner, Jimmy Uso! Jimmy Uso is able to get the win over his own brother, Jay. I'm sure there's mixed emotions here for Jimmy, but I think he should be proud. He proved he really is nobody's, well, you know. Still family, but it'll be interesting to see the future repercussions from tonight.